Hey everybody and welcome to the very first episode of Mike's Muscles and Moonshine. Today we are going to be making the official drink of New Orleans, the Sazerac Cocktail. Um, I'll just tell you guys all now, I, I'm not, I can't just follow the book correctly because uh, I'm not that smart. But we're going to do our best here. I probably should have been a little bit better prepared for what I actually needed. But here's a glass. And uh, I'm going to go off of memory here because uh, that's just how I roll. This one we're going to use Whistle Pig Rye. I don't remember how to make this drink. So we're going to do the absinthe. I am pretty positive it was something along these lines. Just a little bit, a little bit of absinthe in there to coat the glass. Just want to get it in there, in there a little bit. We're just going to grab a little bit of a pinch of Rooney Dooney right in there. The toss in there, that pinch of sugar, because that's how we roll. Now we are going to grab some rye whiskey, which I believe. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Bam, got that in there, got that in there. All right, rye whiskey, rye whiskey, we got that. Hmm, I don't remember. I do not. A bunch of free liquor down here, so. Some brandy. I believe this is where most of the dark color of the drink comes from. Got the brandy. Now we're going to stir. Stir it up. There you go. A little bit of a Sazerac cocktail right there. Traditionally, uh, you'd also use a li uh, lemon. Sorry, a lemon peel. Get that. Uh, get that around there. Squeeze some of that juice. Yeah, really coat that in there. And then you ready to try it. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's delicious. <sighs> All right. Uh, thanks for coming to this week's episode of Mike's Muscles and Moonshine. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know what's left. Uh, let's think of a, a workout. A workout. Um, so. Okay. Well, after a poorly made drink, uh, this week's workout is going to be the deadlift which I will show you right here. Um, there are different ways of doing the deadlifts, such as sumo deadlifts and just your traditional deadlifts. You can use a trap bar or you can use a regular barbell. You can even use dumbbells if you want to, but very beneficial. Um, it's, I, in my personal opinion, is a very high risk, high reward workout because if you do, uh, they say, you know, leave your ego at the door of the gym. You don't want to go in and hurt yourself trying to push yourself to do too much um so if you go in there and you know you try to lift above your means it's it's a very it could be a very harmful thing for you which goes for any workout but deadlifts especially especially if you see people that round their back and just really just try to get it up but keep good form uh, this isn't a form channel this isn't going to be like showing you proper form all that stuff but talk about it i know at least in my experience my motivation or when I really, really want to get out there and work out is when I see other people doing it because it really pushes me to try to better myself, try to, you know, try to be on their level or even higher. I just want to be better. I want to be a better me. And uh, that's just what we're going to do with this channel. We're going to be motivating everybody. Everybody, this is this is how it's going to go. All right. Uh, yeah, that's a test run. Test run. Did I shut off? <laughs>